Hi, Greg here. Today is July 4th, and in the United States, it's Independence Day. So to celebrate, I decided that I would build an American flag out of Lego, and I would share it with you here today. This was a very easy build, although very repetitive. It's a lot of alternating of colors, as you can see. That's the typical American flag. But the hardest part for me was actually finding white bricks. I'm using a set from probably the late 80s, early 90s, back when I was pretty young. I decided to use my old bricks for this, and a lot of the white ones started to turn yellow, so I had to find just the ones that were white as opposed to like a tannish, yellowish color, and that was the hardest part. That goes for the stripes and also on the stars. Just so you can get an idea of the scale of the flag, I'll put a minifig into the scene, and you can see just how big the flag is. You can get a good idea of how this flag's built just by looking at the front of it. I just did red and white alternating stripes going down the front, and they're all interlocked pieces to make it a solid structure. The blue section over here, which signifies where the stars are, is its own separate piece, and I alternated those as well so you can get the illusion that there are the stars on there. And I can kind of just slip that back on. On the side, you can see this is a fairly thin build. It's more of a two-dimensional just display model than it is something that you'll actually play with, but I think it looks pretty nice. In terms of accuracy, not 100%. It doesn't have the correct number of stripes and definitely doesn't have the correct number of stars, but I think in terms of LEGO scale, it really gives it a good impression of what our flag looks like. And as a bonus for you, here is a micro scale United States flag. It uses the same principles as the flag behind it, but just eight pieces. Very easy to build and it makes a nice little display piece. I think this flag is a great build for kids. Parents can do this with their children. You can kind of replicate what I did here, but there's nothing that's set in stone. And you can pretty much do this for any flag of the world. So as long as you have the right colors, anything is possible. I thank you for watching, and I'll have more videos up here soon.